Hey everybody, welcome back. This is Andrew Campbell with Whole Tech Gaming. We're currently in our playthrough of Alice's Pokemon Dumlock. Uh, we just met up with the Goth Queen herself, and we're going to be checking into a room and getting this ceremony going. Yes, please. So I think a couple episodes I asked y'all what Pokemon game was your favorite. And I didn't really give any respect to maybe the 3D games, right? Uh, you know, Pokemon Coliseum, uh, the, what was it? I think Coliseum was for the 64. Stadium. Pokemon Stadium was for the 64. Then there was, hey, you Pikachu, and, you know, the Mystery Dungeons. There are so many Pokemon games. Um, what, you, you know, tell me about them. Well, you don't have to because we already talked about them, but still. Very exciting. Pokemon, very successful franchise, huge fan base. The card game and all the other, you know, it's just a huge franchise. I certainly enjoy it. Um, but, you know, you you do too, I guess. Or else you, it's either you're a, a big fan of me, which I don't think I have a fan base built up to that point yet. Or uh, you really just like Pokemon. And if you just like Pokemon, you are welcome. I just noticed. See the see the statues to the left, right behind the pink. I forget what her name is, or he, he his name, her name. Those those statues are the same as in the Kanto region, right before you go into a gym. I absolutely love it. All right, Challenger Alice was it? Ask that you need to wear uniforms. Let's go ahead and get that going, shall we? Yes, let's change. Change, change, change. <laughs> Oh, uh, that's an old, that's an old, uh, uh, there we go, 69! Oh, she's so cute. Looks like an upside down ass <laughs> with the letters. Wonder, yeah, I'd say that too, buddy, absolutely. 69, you look sharp as a pin. And that 69 there, mm, mm, mm. <laughs> Oh, you can't beat it, you cannot. Yeah, this is one of the more cinematic points of the game. Um, I love it. I love the crowd mentality, the, how they made it look and feel like an actual sporting event. The music, whenever you, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> whenever they uh, have the big Dynamax moments in the gym, love it. The, the music changes and there's urgency and it's a very well made game. It is my pleasure to announce that finally the Gala Region Gym Challenge will now begin! Yes, the Gym Challenge! Look at me up my hands in the air! Participants must defeat the eight gym leaders and gather the eight gym badges to prove their skills as a trainer! Only the, the most worthy will have the honor of challenging the greatest champion in history! Now, I would like to invite the gym leaders to show themselves! Present. <laughs> Ooh, look at that! Look at that! That's butt shots. Oh God, there, there are four gym leaders that I would absolutely tear up. I'm telling you. Yeah, so okay, so it's grass, then water. Nessa, oh my God, I'd break her in half. Kabu, the coolest fucking gym leader this entire in this entire game. I so the only gym leader I lost to in my last playthrough was her. Oh, that's that's a guy. I'm sorry. Opal's cool. I like her character design. She has so much personality. Oh God, just look at her, Melanie. Ah, oh, I'd uh, I'd bend her over something. She is my type. I his that dragon guy's personality makes me sick to my stomach. I'm. <laughs> I, I, I do not like the like that type of person. I certainly don't. But good God, Melanie, look at oh look at the thickness. I gotta get up, get down with the thickness. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? Jesus, oh, I'm getting off a klimt up here. And then here all the challengers. There we go, Alice. You know, it just dawned on me. Did I spell Alice right? <laughs> 
<laughs> I don't know if I, I don't know if I spelled my character's name right or not. I'm pretty sure I did. A L I C E. I'm pretty sure I did. I'm sure someone will tell me <laughs> whenever these come out. There you go, Hop. You get a boner. Oh, here we go. I am kind of jealous of this guy's beard and mustache combo. Plus that flavor saver <laughs> right on his chin, I'm telling you, man. The character design in this game is great. And I don't know how they screwed it up. Because the champion, Leon, like, he, he just looks terrible. I, I hate, I hate his shorts. The shirt's cool, but, like, I don't know, man. His hair's weird, and his... His hat, like, I, I get what they're going for, and they try to make him kind of look like Charizard, and I don't know. I, I, it's just too much. You didn't pull it together, right? It's not a sleek presentation for me. Like, Hop, he, he has a nice character design. He has those grapes on top of his head that kind of jiggle sometimes. I mean, it's okay. Alice, Alice's sweater and beret and skirt looks great. But I don't know, Leon Leon just looks weird to me. That might be a hot take, but it is what it is. The chairman certainly seems to be in high spirits. I need to train. Yes, I do. Please, please don't make me battle hop right now. I need to I need to train. I don't remember what Pokemon's okay, thank God. Alright, cool. So who's first? Is it? Is it? Is it the fire first? Okay, cool. Yeah, so it is grass. That's right. That's good. Okay, good. Cause no, I don't wanna. I don't wanna fight Kabu right now. Kabu, Kabu put my push my shit in. Absolutely. Okay, so we're gonna be going through Route Three. That gives us another opportunity to catch another Pokemon. Is everybody ready for that? Anybody have a, okay, challenge your house. The chairman asked for me to deliver a gift to you. I don't want it, but I'll take it. Flying taxis. That's going to be good, because we actually need to use that right now. We need to go back, because I believe there was a, a station that we had uh, in uh, Wedgehurst, I think. Yeah, Wedgehurst. There was something about a rare Pokemon. Oh, oh see how see, I like that. They they programmed it into where people are gonna be giving you a nice send off. That's that's special. I like that. that that's cool. Uh, okay, I need to access that through town map, right? Yeah, town map. Okay, that's the wild area. This is Wedgehurst. Would you like to use a flying taxi? Yes, please. Big ol' ass Corviknight down there. Hell yeah. Okay, so I forget. Let's check the Pokemon just to make sure. Because I don't know what's going to happen here. Okay. Alright. Alright. Okay. Alright. Okay. Let's do this. Ah, uh, too, too high. I apologize. I just had a, I don't know why, but I just had a flashback to the movie Titan AE, <laughs> if anybody's ever seen that movie. There's a song, that's, the, the soundtrack on that movie's pretty badass, and I like the, what's, what the hell's up with that? The train to the Isle of Armor has arrived? Look at that lady's hat. Why is everything so tie-dye? What's going on with her? What? Do you have an armor pass? No, but she's got enough balls. <laughs> oh, jeez. What? Slowpoke? What? What? The, why does it have yellow stuff on its head? Somebody pee on that poor Slowpoke? What's going on here? Okay, what's going on? Yeah, this is the first time I've ever seen a Glarn Slowpoke. Yeah, 
Or am I supposed to... Is this the Pokemon? Okay. Slow. You're a Pokemon trainer, right? Uh, yeah. Okay. Hey, I get to catch it. Son of a bitch. I don't remember... I don't remember getting this. My battle... Yes. So this counts. I... This isn't a route. This isn't... Well, it's not a random encounter either, is it? I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and allow this. I'm gonna I'm gonna allow this. This is this is acceptable. I'm worried though, because I can only use razor leaf. So here we go, it's a 50-50 shot. Either it gets one shotted and it's dead forever. Okay, good. Because it's it's a buff boy, right? Slow pokes. Acid. That's super effective. I need to be careful. One more razor leaf and we'll try to catch it. The slow pokes have a lot of defense. And that, the Slowpoke is going to save my ass when it comes to fighting Kabu. Absolutely. But we'll see. I don't know. Uh, let's go ahead and whip my balls out here. Let's give it... Uh, it's a water type, so let's go ahead and use a net ball. Yeah, the different Pokeballs give you different uh, catch advantages whenever you use it. And... Yeah, we got it! Hell yeah, we got a weird-ass Slowpoke. So what are we going to name it? Uh, what are we going to name it? I don't want to name it something obscene like Pisshead. Mm. Yes, I would like to name it. What am I going to what am I going to name it? Uh It kind of looks like it has a mane, but I don't want to name it Leo. That no. It kind of reminds me of an X-Men. Okay. So how about... We go with Bub. <laughs> because uh, Wolverine says Bub a lot, right? Outstanding. We got a Pokemon. So I'm going to count it only under the guise of... It wasn't caught there. I, it was caught in town, right? I actually had to fight it. I didn't know it was here. So, there you go. I'm going to count it as something that I'll be able to catch. And, it, you know, I'm only doing one Pokemon for the wild area, so give me a pass on this one. I, I need a beefy Slowpoke for sure. That, that character was weird. A good weird. A good weird. The tie-dye was a bit much with the top hat and the, the floating Pokeballs, but whatever. Judge not, lest ye be judged, or whatever that old saying is. Let's, uh, let's check her out. Bub. <laughs> Hell yeah. Okay, we need to, we need to move magic up here. Swap Bub. Swap Mr. Bean. Go ahead and give him a berry, why not? There we go. Now we'll heal it up. Heal Bub up and we'll be all good to go. So from that, we need to start our journey to go to the grass gym or we can do a little bit of exploring and uh, training, which I kind of feel like we need to do, right? I mean, I might be a little overcautious here, but we need to check. We need to check Bub's moves. Is what we need to do. Okay, it's it's just a plain psychic type. It does not have a water typing. Good. See, that's case in point. If I would have just battled with him, it would have had Growl, and I would have been in trouble. So we're going to go ahead. Acid's going to be good for whenever we fight the Grass Trainer. But we need to go ahead and stick Confusion out first. That's just common sense, right? It's more powerful. It's got the chance to confuse the enemy whenever you hit. I mean, it's, it's just something that must be done. One does not simply have a slow poke without using Confusion. 
What's up here? Oh, I just invaded this dude's house. I don't know why I did it, but I did it. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe it just reminded me of home. Let's go back to the train station. Was it the train? I didn't get here by train station. I got here by flying. So let's do that again. Okay. So we did Route 2. We made it to the wild area via train. And, oh, the wild area is broken up into sections. Nope. One, one Pokemon per wild area. That's it. So in this entire area, I'm only going to catch one Pokemon. And I probably need to do do it strategically. But we'll see. Okay, so we're going to go there. Uh, I think I have to go through Route 3 here. So we're going to be... So Route 3 I'll be able to catch a Pokemon. Route 4 I'll be able to catch a Pokemon. And then our first gym. Uh, let, let's go ahead and go to the wild area and catch a Pokemon. Let's do that. Let's get that out of the way, shall we? Because I don't want to have to continually reference that oh i've still got to catch a wild pokemon out of the wild area okay let's head over let's head over heels <laughs> let's go ahead and okay magic's out do i want let's put bub out how's that bub's got some defense plus he's got a way more hp and that's the thing if we're going to be catching something we need we need our our placeholder pokemon to be able to hold his own, right? Alright, so let's take a read of the area. There's a Butterfree. Over here by this tower is where there are some ghost types and whatnot. So that's kind of where I want to check it out. Okay, a bunch of bundle bees. There is, a, I don't know what that's called, a dweddle? A dwibble? I don't know. What's that? Oh crap, a Growlithe. Well, that's pretty cool. It's a sunny day out, right? So, oh God, what the hell's that? A Golurk or whatever? Okay, there are the ghost types. Ah, uh, I guess. I'm not. I'm not gonna be touch. No, big guy. No, 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 no. Okay, he didn't follow me. That's good. All right, let's 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 do a little bit of. This is gonna be a gamble, right? Okay, so this is where the this is where the oh, that's where the wild encounter would have been. I, I went too long. I gotta watch out because there's crabs. Okay, there it is. Here we go. This is our one wild area Pokemon, and it is a Pancham. Fuck. <laughs> Son of a bitch. I, I guess it's not that bad, but yeah, damn it. I really don't. I, I don't like this Pokemon too much, to be honest. And it's a dark type. Oh, that's not good, man. That's not. I have to try to catch it though. Uh, will a psychic type move even hit it? It's a dark type, so I don't think it will. I think the only way I'm going to be able to catch this is just throwing balls. That's garbage. Why did I do this to myself? Ah, oh, god damn it. Well, let's, let's throw an experimental heal ball and see if that catches it. One, two, three... Yeah! <laughs> that was a... Oh, I hate this Pokemon, but... No, I don't hate it, but it's not my favorite, right? It's not something like... It wasn't a pleasant surprise like Mr. Bean, right? I didn't get a Lotad, I got a Pancham. Is Pancham going to be great? Absolutely, because I think it, it's a fighting type. Oh, shit, so if I would have used Confusion, it would have absolutely destroyed it. But it becomes a Dark type, and it has Dark type moves, but it's a fighting type. And it's a girthy fighting type. Let's... What are we going to name him? I... Oh, by the way, just FYI, I absolutely fucking hate pandas. And I'll explain that on a different... So... I know what I'm going to call this. How do you... How do you... How do you spell that? Let's just do that. No, that's not it. Uh, S-T-R... E A K. Oh yes, they call him the streak. <laughs> oh shit. So yeah, streak is in shit streak from a dirty pair of underwear because I hate Pancham so fucking much. Great. 
Awesome. I'm not salty at all. How about you guys? All right. This is Andrew Campbell with Whole Tech Gaming. Thank you very much for sticking around. Next time on episode 10, we're going to be heading towards the gym. It's very hot out. We need to get Alice back indoors. Um, I look forward to having y'all back. Uh, have a great day. Bye-bye.